say hi? Can you say hi? Hi friends! Welcome back to my channel. Hi. <laughs> hi. Are you saying hi? Can you show them Mickey? I guess oh. this is Minnie. You giving Minnie a kiss? Hi. Hi. Say, oh. Alright guys, today's video is all about Miss Zara! <laughs> oh, okay, let's get Minnie. So I'm gonna try to keep her in this video. I don't know how well it's gonna go over. We'll see. But I wanted to do a fun little 12 month update about little Mrs. Z. We just went to her doctor's appointment today and we have all of her stats. She is officially one. I cannot believe it. This day has come and gone. And we still have some leftover party decorations behind me. And this is the life of a one year old. We still have party decorations behind me, as you can see. What? Can you say hi? No? Okay. I'm just going to put it down. For those of you who are new to my channel, hi, my name is Dana. I make mommy, lifestyle, beauty, makeup, skincare, food, all the kinds of different videos you could possibly imagine. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, you should be so you don't miss any of my future uploads. Yes, that a binky. Because I make really fun videos and you should subscribe to my channel. Yes, what do you have? So I do have a 12 month old, one year old daughter now, which is so weird. I can't believe it was a year ago that I had Zara. So if you haven't watched my birth story, I'll leave a link to it somewhere on the screen. Probably over here. <laughs> I don't know. But I did do a birth story. It's not my greatest video. It was one of my very first videos I ever did. And I said that I was 41 weeks and one day when I went to labor. No, I was 40 weeks and one day. I was, she was born three days after my due date at like 12.07 a.m. Anyways, besides the point, she is now one. I can't believe it. It was definitely, what are you doing? What are you doing? It was definitely a bittersweet day for me. And honestly, for a few weeks leading up to it. Hey, no. Also guys, I really need to make this video short because she is awake. Filming videos with Zara awake is never a good idea. Let's just put it that way. Also, my lighting's really bright. So if I'm squinting, that's why. Like I was saying, it's been really bittersweet for me the last few weeks up until she turned one and on her first birthday because my baby is one and she's just growing up so fast, I feel like, and just makes me sad. I don't know why. It's this weird, like, I feel like contradicting thing. Like, I, like I want her to grow up. I'm excited to see her personality grow more. Like, I have been loving that recently. But still, there's nothing better than little babies. So I'm just a little heartbroken, <laughs> to be honest, and I've cried a lot. But the day of her first birthday has come, it is gone, and she's still a little baby. So I can survive for now. Yes. Yes. But what didn't help was on her first birthday, she took her first steps which I'll get into in a little bit. But let's first start with Zara's stats. So Zara is 12 months old, obviously. She is 17 pounds, two ounces. So she is in the 12th percentile in weight. But the doctor says that she is perfect. She is gaining weight like she should be. She's just my petite little dainty girl, huh? Honestly, she's bigger than I was when I was one. I was only 16 pounds, so we're doing good over here. Then her height is 29 inches, so she's in the 44th percentile for her height. And her head circumference, 18.3 inches. 88th percentile. She's got a massive noggin. Eight. Which makes sense that she's got a big brain in there. Whoa. Okay. Does make a little bit of sense because Zara developmentally is very much ahead of the game. She knows a bunch of words. She knows mama, dada, uh oh. She knows. 
those. Booby milk. Gosh dang it, she just looked at me. <laughs> she knows that word. She knows the word baby. She associates these words with the actual like object. So she knows that baby is a baby. And she also knows doggy and kitty, which is really cute. She knows thank you. It's more like thank you. You say thank you. Close. So she knows a bunch of different words. And I feel like every day she's kind of like mastering one it's really cool to see so she's definitely ahead of the game on that which scares me yes but she is perfectly healthy the doctor is very pleased she is eating three meals a day now like human food i do not feed her any more baby food i do have a little bit of baby food left that i want to just kind of get through so i'll make sure i feed her that it's not that much but i just don't want it to go to waste and what else? She's still nursing four times a day. So I've now breastfed her for a whole year, which I never thought I would ever do, to be honest. I never thought I would make it this far, but we have. And I'm actually really, really, really proud of myself. I just, I can't believe I did it, to be honest. I can't believe we did it. Like, we survived, barely. We were holding on your life there for a while it was rough anyways so now 12 months has gone and passed and I need to think about like if and when I want to wean her I'm still really up in the air about it I'm gonna do a video like dedicated to my breastfeeding experience with Zara and maybe talk a little bit about weaning there I can introduce whole milk to her now we'll see what we do Honestly, I don't really know. Zara's really loving nursing now, which has not been a thing for a while. So now that she loves it, I don't mind it as much. And she's only nursing like so often during the day, so it's not as bad, but we'll see. Okay, let's talk about Zara's birthday party. So yesterday was her birthday. Well, actually, when you're watching this it is now two days ago. June 27th, 2018 is her first birthday. We threw a little mini party nothing super over the top i just decorated the house a little bit if you haven't seen baby's first birthday video i put all of it out there so you can see the decorations and stuff like that we just had a few friends over and their two little babies are as friends over as well for her birthday just to eat and hang out and have fun and it was really fun i really enjoyed it we all enjoyed it zara had her smash cake she opened up some presents it was really fun i'll add in some footage here throughout well what's crazy was when zara was opening her presents she took her first steps it was seriously i was telling a friend of mine literally like a what was it like four days before i'm like i'm just hoping she walks for the first time not when other people are around because i'm going to be very emotional about it because it's already been really hard for me that she is growing up because i just want her to stay my little baby forever and then when she walks it's just like now you're really not a baby anymore so i was telling that to her so i'm like anytime that people are over i'm like please don't walk please don't walk please don't walk because for the last few months honestly if zara wanted to she could walk she just chooses not to like she walks all around furniture crawls stands up every i mean she is very coordinated and i'm shocked she hasn't walked earlier but she just hasn't been into it so i just was praying that she wouldn't walk in front of people and then she did and i was an emotional wreck basically i was like oh gosh my baby walked on her first birthday it was just it was really cool. It was also, I was not expecting it. So like really kind of caught me off guard. We don't have footage of it. My friend did catch a picture of her and it just, it was so sad to me. <laughs> but I'm also really excited for her because it will be really fun when she can walk and go and do things and stuff like that. Where is my child? One moment. Anyways. Not my child, she's mine. <laughs> One of Zara's favorite gifts that she got for her birthday was a baby doll. She absolutely loved it. 
loved it. She still loves it. <laughs> Anytime she says it, she's like, Papi, Papi, and loves to play with her. She makes noises. And she like has a bottle too and a binky. What? And it was really sweet. So Zara had taken her baby. What are you doing? It was actually really sweet. Zara took her baby and then was putting it in our friend's baby's car seat. Like she knew that the baby would go in there. It was so weird. How do you know these things? How do you know? She is very smart, that little girl, seriously. But yeah, Zara's party went super well. She was super well behaved. We got tons of pictures. You should follow me on Instagram so you can see all of it. I had a lot of fun taking pictures of her and just celebrating her and her first birthday. We did lots of fun things on that day. Besides getting the party ready, I took her to the pool. She loves going to the pool and we went on a run. It's also another one of her favorite things to do is just be outside. So I was like, we'll be outside as long as you want today, besides nap time. So that's what we did and we had so much fun. And yeah, I can't believe it's come and gone. It really is a bittersweet thing and I guess what is holding me together to be honest is one I know that it's gonna be more exciting she's gonna be come even more fun than she already is but also it was I don't know it's like this super irrational fear that I knew this wouldn't happen but like I was gonna wake up and she just was like a kid rather than my baby anymore but obviously she's still a little baby so, yeah, just a weird mom stuff, you know. <laughs> but that is it for today's video. Let me go grab Zara, actually. Hey, Zara, can you come with me to the end of this video? Well, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and loved watching us celebrate Zara's first birthday. Oh, baby girl. If you like this kind of video, definitely give it a thumbs up if you did and hit that subscribe button down below. I would love to have you here and join the subby fam. And whoa. Whoa. And yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye-bye.